Okay, so welcome back to Rainbow and Lovers. Today I'm going to show you guys the difference between this metal hook and the plastic hook. So I just got this metal hook in the mail, and this kit, it's the upgrade kit. It comes with the metal hook and the mini loom, and this is just printed on there. Um, the mini loom is, it's just a mini loom, and it makes like fishtails and small bracelet patterns. So, yeah. And then on the back of it, if you get this, it comes with a secret code. And we you, don't know what that is for. Yeah, yeah no. it doesn't tell you what it's for, but you can scratch it off for, and we're it's gonna, for rainbowloom.com. We're so. going to try it after. That. I haven't done that yet, but yeah, it's just a secret code. Okay, so now we're going to open it. Oh, <laughs> sort of pops out. Okay, so, so we're going to scratch that later on the video. Baby. Yeah. So you can see it's just a little thing, and that's not real bands. So. This is the this box, is. and you can keep the box if you want to keep the hook in, but you don't need to. So you have a mini loom that kind of looks different from the other ones because it has this. Yeah. And it has, as you can see, it's like metal and stuff like that, and you can pick what color I'm pretty sure you can pick what color you want. Okay, so you can get this hook in three different colors. I got mine in pink, and you can get it in pink, green, or blue. So this is the mini loom, like I was saying, but you, it's also your hook protector so you stick your hook in this when you're done with it and it looks like that so yeah I recommend this so it doesn't get damaged or anything so this is the metal hook and the plastic hook and they are they're different because of the metal and the plastic but they're actually the exact same size if you put them next to each other so same size but the difference is first of all it's metal and it if you look closely you can see the arch in this one, so it's a lot easier to grab bands with it. So this one you can see. Yeah, see that one has an arch. In yeah, it. I'll show you this one. This one you can see. Okay, I did that one. Looks like that. like straight, and, and then this one's just like kind of like a curve. And then of. it's a lot more curved. So yeah. Now we're gonna show you the difference between them on the look. Okay, so now we are gonna show you the differences. So we're looping it with the plastic hook right now so just keep looming it and this the plastic hook is good but it's the metal hook takes them a lot easier so oops just fix that sorry so we're just gonna loop a few with this one and then go to the metal hook these bands are so hard to use yeah these are tie-dye bands and they're sort of harder so they're now like if it's hard to use with the plastic hook you'll see the difference with the metal hook okay you can use the metal hook okay now we'll use the metal hook so, this that one. was the plastic hook, and this is the new metal hook. Whoa. <laughs> is it, does it work better? Yes, way better. I you think can see it's a lot easier to pull the bands and a lot easier to, like, um, move them around. Yeah, so I think they should have just made this in the beginning. Like, I don't know if they did, but they should just, like, this should just come with your kit. Like, Yeah, it's a really good hook, and they did just make some new kits that come with it, with the rainbow loom and the mini loom and the plastic hook and bands. I mean, not plastic hooks, sorry, metal hook. <laughs> and you can tell the difference between the boxes. It says yeah, it's it so much easier. Now we're going to try to do this one again and see what the difference is. So, yeah. Oh, see, that does that. Like, it just, like, brings it over, and it's Yeah, so annoying. there's definitely a difference between them. Yeah, that one, it never happened. Okay, that. okay so the metal hook is a lot better for, like, looming and, like, all bracelets, and it's... it's it's especially better for um, charms, like big charms, because there's a lot of cap bands on big charms. And this is where the plastic hook typically breaks. That's why this is a lot better hook, because people were saying that their plastic hook was breaking way too much. And you can see it breaks usually right here. So if you're trying to get like out a band, and it'll, it'll bend. And you can see it, if your plastic hook, if you make a lot of charms with your plastic hook, you can see it start to bend if there's some white right here, because that means it's starting to bend. But with the metal hook, when you do a charm, it's, that's what it's meant for, for like hard, a lot of bands in one peg. It won't bend because it's metal. Yeah, because um, sometimes when you, like, I tried doing a charm one time, which really did not work out because my metal, because my hook would not, like, go through all of them. It was so annoying, so. Yeah, I just want to show you one more thing. Okay, so it's, this hook is, like, this hook. So, 
Yeah. You wouldn't really Those try to make... Those <laughs> are so bad. They last like two seconds. Yeah, you and please then they die. do not try to make a charm with this hook because um, you probably will like definitely break That's like one hook. of the crazy loom ones and those like work really bad because like they're so plastic. They're even worse than these. Yeah, these are actually really good. Just they break like after a while. So, but this one... Yeah, please, that one would die like, like, like don't the try, first time. <laughs> don't try to do like that many cat bands with this because... Because it will break. Okay, so I have some questions to ask her. Um, is a lot is the green kind of like that, like a lime green or like a dark green? Um, uh, it's if you look on Amazon or the Rainbow web store website, you can see the um the blue, the pink, and the green. And the green does look a little bit darker than this green. I don't know because I don't have it, but it does look pretty dark. But it is like brighter. So it's like somewhat like a grass green. Yeah. Oh. Okay. Oh. So, yeah, that is the difference between these hooks. Okay, so I'm going to tell you guys the difference between these two. This one's right here is for the metal hook. That's what they come from the package, and this one comes from the from your um, the plastic hook. hook. These are the okay. mini looms that so come The difference with them. is this, see how this one's a lot bigger than that one's a tiny bit. This one will be a lot more easier to hook with because there's more space, and so I find it's easier for your hook to go down in. And then this is, there's really, like, no difference to them other than this. Like, I know, like, there's an open space, but we try both of them in it, and, like, there's really no difference. But this one is, it's a lot better. The new one, this is the new one for the metal hook, and it's just better because right here you can fit more bands. And I know when I tried to use this for, like, a fishtail, it's the bands sort of fall off, and they're, not, they're harder to um, loop over. So that's yeah. why this one's better. Plus, it has that open space, which sort of makes it easier for um, bracelets. I haven't tried this one yet, but, yeah. So, that's the difference between those. Okay, guys, just one last thing. If you are getting a loom or a hook or, well, any type of hook, but especially this metal hook or loom, you want to make sure it says here. It says rainbow loom on it, and it says those words because you don't want to buy a fake one. So fake ones will break more, and they're not from the actual Rainbow Loom, um, Rainbow Loom brand. So, yeah, I just want to tell you that. So if you get one of these mini looms and they don't say anything on it, that means they're probably fake. So, yeah. Okay, thanks for watching this video. Um, like and subscribe. Like this video and subscribe to our channel. Bye.